What is going on, everybody? This is SDoc21, welcoming you to my YouTube channel. That's a pretty fancy intro you got right there, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What is going on, everybody? This is SDoc21, welcoming you to episode number 58 of my Minecraft Let's Play, guys. Now, why am I out here, and where the heck am I? Well, if you're looking at my world map, right... I'm over on like the left side sort of type deal and there's a reason why I'm out here because I found something pretty freaking awesome and I want to show you guys and I want to get this thing back to base. It's a killer bunny! So we're going to have to go through the trouble of getting this thing all the way back home, one, without it dying, and two, without me dying. That would be preferable. So we got to... Oh, it's lunging! So we got to have this thing chase me all the way back home, which I can't even tell you how far away it is. Because I don't really know. It is like three and a half to four maps away. Don't... Killer Bunny, don't do that. Will he follow me through water? That's the question. No. All right, so we're going to have to try to lead the sucker around on the land. And why do I want to keep the killer bunny? Well, I don't really have a reason why I shouldn't. It's it's a different mob. It's a 1 in 2,500 chance that a bunny will spawn in and be hostile towards players. And this is actually a reference to the, I believe it's the Bunny of Canterbury? Or something along those lines. It has gone through several changes, actually. As it used to have, like, blood coming around its mouth. And it used to have blood on its paws. But now it is just a white bunny with horizontal eyes rather than vertical eyes. And it is also pre-named as the Killer Bunny. Now, naming a bunny the Killer Bunny will not have the same effect, unfortunately. And I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to have to pull up my coordinates here just to make sure I'm going in the right direction which I'm not, which is why I needed to... Okay, we need to go this way. So anyways, we need to keep this bunny's attention and keep it chasing me all the way back home, which can be a struggle, apparently. Oh, gosh! It made me jump! Guys, I physically jumped! <laughs> it scared the dickens out of me! Oh my... Two? No way! Two killer bunnies! That's... Okay, multiply... Mul oh, multiply... Whew. Multiply 2,500 by 2,500. Just, just do that for me real fast. Holy cow, these guys are aggressive, and they hurt a lot. Oh my, oh my, I don't, how do I get both of these back home? All right, we're gonna, we're gonna do one, and then if we, oh man, because they're both coming, I really want to get both of them home. We'll leave that other one where it's at right now. We're gonna take this one home. And then we're going to come out and get the second killer bunny, guys. Okay, so anyways, with that number, holy crap, they have got a lunge for days. Anyways, that number is the probability of finding two of them in one video. That is ridiculous. Two killer bunnies? Come get me. Ouch. Okay, well, I'm in a bad spot. I'm stuck. Stop it! All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to get away from this bunny. Eat a little bit and then pull up these coordinates again. All right, good. I was moving in the correct direction, at least sort of. Stupid bunny. You know, I'm just going to, like, keep my eyes on it. Although the last time I did that, it made me jump. Ooh, jeez. Don't kill me, please. Okay, cool. But this bunny is ridiculous, guys. I don't know. I don't know if you guys find it interesting, but I find it interesting to find a killer bunny. Because I've hardly done anything with rabbits in Minecraft at all. And to find the killer bunny is just, like, icing on the cake. Where'd he go? Oh, did he... F oh, okay. He's right there. I was going to say, did he fall down in a ravine or in water? Because that would suck. Because I don't want to lose this guy. I want this little guy to come home. And we're going to put him on display. Maybe make a nice little cage for... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're going to make a bold move. Ouch. Bunny, you're blocking me. Bruh. Bruh, you're blocking me. All right. Come on. Keep coming. Keep coming. Watch me die doing this. Um. So, yeah. There's also one other variant of bunnies that you will not find naturally out in the wild, and that is a bunny named Toast. Uh, the reason is there was a couple of people who lost their bunny and wanted and reached out to... I don't remember who they reached out to. I think it was Jeb. But either way, they reached out to the crew of Mojang and asked them to implement their bunny into the game. So if you name a bunny Toast it will change the appearance of that bunny to be uh, like a black and a white, more of a more of a bigger, large spotted bunny rather than the usual modeled spots. Killer bunny. This guy is aggressive, and that's what scares me the most, but I think that also wields the most power. 
And I really hope it doesn't become nighttime here, as we need to keep this dude in our pockets, and we need to actually head that way. So this, I believe this is the correct dark oak forest that surrounds the house. It's either that one or it's the one out by the river, if you're familiar with the, the home settlement area and its map. It's just so dark under here. I really don't want like a creeper to come up behind me and then blow me up. That would not be preferable, and it is becoming nighttime, which is going to make getting this stupid bunny back so much harder. All right, we are sort of there. Sort of almost kind of there. All right, this baby zombie is going to give me an issue, so let me back up away from the bunny a little bit. I'm on day 199 in this series. Oh, my goodness. All right, we're, we might have to lose that. That's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Alright, I know where it's at. We're going to come out and find it back during the daytime. I can't do this during the night. It is just way too dangerous. We just got a creeper hole that might have blown up the bunny. <sighs> Alright, so we got to keep... We, get, we just got to head this way, basically. It's almost a straight shot this way. Oh, goodness. I didn't expect this to actually take more than a day long, and then we're, heck <laughs> we're gonna have to get the second one over. I wonder if you can use, like, a, uh, a lead and just run really fast and hope that the bunny doesn't catch up to you and start beating the snot out of you. Huh. I think we're just gonna try it this way for... Creeper City out here. I ain't about that life. I do not play with creepers. That is not... That's not what I do. I don't go gunpowder gun powder sh hunting. My goodness, I'm tripping up on my words because I got all distracted. Oh, I gotta fix that torch. Um, um, okay, no mobs over here. Let's eat these potatoes. Oh, I need food, too. Because in order to not die, we need to keep our health good. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not okay. 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 My computer just froze there for a second if you didn't notice that. That's fine. It hit me a couple of times, whatever. All right. It is going to be daytime. I can tell you that this game is actually substantially harder when it gets to nighttime, and you saw my local difficulty is 4 point something. It's pretty tough out in these streets. What is it now? Yeah, it's 5.59 out here. My goodness, it's just because I'm so close to home. Oh yeah, <laughs> my little embarrassing text box. I thought it was nighttime, so I was standing there over top of the bed just holding down the button. I was like, it's supposed to be nighttime. Let me sleep. Come on. Come on. All right, so now the issue is we're going to have to head out there again. I just locked myself in, that was smart. But we're gonna have to head back out and hopefully find this killer bunny within that dark oak forest. And if we can't, we can always go try to find the second one. I'm taking steak with me. 44 of them. I gotta get back to breeding some animals. Alright, so anyways, I need... Oh, you're a skeleton. You look like a dog for a second. I was like, bro, there's a dog. Oh, level 30. Alright, so we need to go to negative 880 and then like negative 220-ish. So let's head out that way. I really want to get these bunnies back. Two killer bunnies? Oh man, that would be awesome. That'd just be spectacular. So really, we're going to be battling the elements here to try to find this bunny again. Alright, let's just let's just keep headed out. I'm trying to think of, like, was any of this familiar ter territory? Oh, it's because there's nothing to jump up on. I was like, bro. Alright, let's just keep heading this way then. Yeah, this is easier to traverse. All right, negative. It was like negative two twenty, right? Something like that. If not, I'm gonna have to run that tape back, and watch it myself so I can find this bunny. Cause we are getting this bunny back. Dang it. All right, negative. Wasn't it like two twenty? I might just have to search around here in this uh, this area for a while. Oh, it was also negative eight eighty. It's like negative 882. So let's get out here. And I'll tell you, the first time I got hit, I was just walking out there in the plains area, and I got hit by something. And I turned around, I was like, yo, who just hit me? What just hit me? And then it was a bunny chasing after me, smacking me around. So I was like, bruh. All right, so we're just going to stay on this 880-something area and keep looking. Because I don't remember exactly where the bunny was, so we just got to keep our eyes open for anything white. Come on, bunny, please, for the people on YouTube, show up. So that's the thing, like, these bunnies have a mind of their own, and they'll walk wherever they they please. 
So this bunny could be several hundred blocks away from here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait! Wait! Just wait! I found him. Hey, bud. Ouch! Don't do that. Stop! Stop chasing me! I wish these bunnies didn't hit so hard. They are... They're, they're pretty strong mobs. For being a little bunny, they're pretty strong. All right, we're gonna have to get up here a little bit more and then eat. Let's see if this bunny followed. He did not. So that's the issue, and then you lose them, and then you come down here, and they're hopping around, and then you don't realize it, and then BAM! They hit you, and then you jump. Alright, come on, bud. Come on, bunny. Oh, you're right there. Come on. Come on, traverse on land to get me. Use your, use your, use your little animal AI. Come on, bud. Stuck. I got gotcha. you. Come here. But, bro, he's gonna, he's gonna turn around, and smack me. Look at this thing. He's running away. Little punk. Ah! <laughs> All right, we're gonna, we're gonna get in the water here, and get him to follow us on land. Let's bring up those coordinates again. Oh, he's gonna follow us in water. All right. We need to go about a hundred and some more blocks. Can we get you around this pond? Yeah, we can. We're gonna need to go about another, <clears throat> oh goodness, about a hundred, 200 blocks or so. So our settlement is at just about 70, 770, or negative, sorry, negative 70, or positive 70, 770, or so. Obviously, the negative would be on the, the 770 part, as I messed up my village coordinates several times. But we're about 150 blocks away from home, and now the issue is, where do I put him? I don't believe he's hostile towards other mobs. Maybe I can, like, trap him in with a pig. Oh yeah, I got a pig. This dude is stuck! Hit me. Ouch. Come on. There we go. I just sacrificed a little bit of health, a little bit of durability on my armor. Ouch. It's alright. Come on, killer bunny. Oh, next episode is going to be so much fun trying to get that other one. Oh, goodness. Come on, buddy. Come on, I got three more minutes to get you back for the people of YouTubes. Come on. Come on. Still following? Good bunny. If this gets to be nighttime again, I'm going to be so mad. All right, I saw a roof behind me. Oops. <laughs> Screenshot. My bad. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. Ouch. Traverse! Traverse! Follow me. Follow me. Don't don't kill yourself. Bunnies like to take stupid jumps downwards and try to kill themselves, so don't do that. Keep coming. Come on, buddy. I can't believe I brought a killer bunny back home. This is freaking awesome, guys. Absolutely outstanding. Come on, bud. Come here, Mr. Bunny. I got a bunch of carrots in here. You want some carrots? Ouch. No, actually, you want to kill me. Look at that. Two hits, and I'm already down one and a half hearts. And I've got protection something or other on one of my pieces of armor. Ooh, I'm going to need to enchant some more armor. It's all about to go away. I was going to stick you in the library with the enchanting room. Oh, I could put you in the brewing room. Oh, that's going to be a whoop doo wop to get out of there, though. So I'm going to pass on that one. Come on, bud. Don't worry. I got you. I got you. We're gonna make you a nice little cage with glass to display you on, and and I don't know. We'll we'll make it around here somewhere. You're gonna look so pretty. Let's put him in here with the pig. I can maybe whoop de wop to out of here to try to not get smacked around a bunch by this bunny. Bunnies can't hop a fence, can they? Ouch. Aha! Trap now, ain't you, sucker? And will you follow me? Ouch! He just, he just kicked me through the fence. All right, we're going to we're gonna figure out if this guy can actually get us, though. Come on, killer bunny. Come on, come get, come get me. Won't even change your AI. I don't think he can get out of there. So we're just going to leave him. And once you're further enough away, far, further enough? Far enough away, he won't try to track you to kill you or anything like that. So I don't think he can go anywhere. Cool beans, guys. We got ourselves a killer bunny. Sorry, I had to burp there really fast. There is something I am going to add for this this next journey, though, to get this other one a bed. 
We need a bed. All right, so anyways, guys, crunch those numbers, though. Like I said at the beginning, a, a killer bunny spawns at a rate of 1, 000, 1 out of 2,500 bunnies is hostile towards humans. And we've got it right here. And the chance of finding two of them is 1 over 2,500 times 1 over 2,500, guys. That is ridiculous. What's 25 times 25? That's 1... 125 add four zeros to that so it's 1,250,000th of a chance that is absolutely outstandingly ridiculous and now we've got a killer bunny yeah now we gotta actually figure out where we want to put these little fellas though because we're gonna get two of them that's amazing. All right, guys. So I'm going to sign out the episode here because I'm super excited and ready to go for next time getting a second killer bunny, guys. So anyways, have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all next time. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please click on either one of the videos playing currently on your screen right now to take you to the two videos that I have posted last. Also, guys, subscribe because it is absolutely 100% free. And by all means, please stalk me on social media. Bye-bye.